Hello everyone and welcome back for another edition of 8 Minutes with Aaron. I am of course your host Aaron and today we are going to go over some exciting news in the anime aspect of the Funko world and the little concerns that I have with it. So let's get rolling with a fresh edition of this guy right here, Aaron. Now, I know I've already gone through this in a previous video, but Funko is going to release some exclusives to the Naruto uh, genre, to the One Piece genre. We went over before we talked about uh, it's, uh, what is this called? Karamamu Naruto, where he's looking pretty fly when he's like in the ultimate Karamamu, where he fuses with them. And then you also have uh, the Minato, what's also coming out, the same version. Now, they don't have a chase version. I, maybe the Naruto does have a chase glow on it. The Minato does not have the chase glow. Of course, I will show you the pictures in the corner of this nice, delicious screen over here. But the major concern that people are having is the fact that they are actually selling the Minato as part of an anime mystery box. That is right, they're tossing it out in a mystery box. That means not only are you going to get Minato, you are going to get five random Funko Pops as well. Now, whether or not they're going to be specifically from the anime genre, well, let's just read out what they posted about this. Expand the bounds of your favorite anime shows to your collection with the anime mystery box. The bundle features six pop figures and an assortment of exclusive and mainline collectibles. It also includes a Minato Yuzumaki and Nine Tails Chakra Mode, which I just skipped over in that sentence. Uh, the pop Minato Nazumaki is ready to protect your anime collection when you are welcome him and the Naruto set. What other surprises will you find in this exclusive Funko <laughs> exclusive mystery box? Uh, yeah, I added some words. I used to do that in school all the time, and the teacher would stop me and say, Excuse me, Aaron, where did you see that word in that sentence? I don't know, I just like to add things. I'm just an adder. Uh, you know, I got two A's. To make a long story short, what are they going to put in this box? Well, it led to a lot of speculation that they might also do this with the upcoming One Piece Marco Funko Pop. Now, you know, I think it was just a fake news story that's been being posted around, or, you know, everyone's looking on Twitter and Facebook, and they're like, hey, what's going on? I know that uh, one person did post it up and said it was fake, and then I guess like two, three, four hours later, I saw it in another person's uh, Instagram account. Now, they're saying that the Marco, though, was going to come with not only the new Marco, I keep saying his name, the new Flock Chopper, which I'll show you another picture in the corner of both of these Funko Pops, which the Chopper is just a Flock version. They are coming out with a common version where you can get everywhere. Funko is really going crazy with this whole shabam of the One Piece Pops and these Funko and the Naruto Funko Pops being released just from the shop. It's kind of a letdown because everyone's always afraid that they're going to sell out or there's going to be some kind of bots that are going to be able to get the back wall of Funko and buy them before everyone else. And it is a major concern. It's, it's very annoying concern uh, because I don't want to deal with it. And when they drop, I don't want to have problems. But they did reveal a special Funko Pop that is coming out. It does have a common and a chase version. People were going crazy over it. And who am I talking about? Well, it can only be one person. That is right. I'm talking about Carrot. I'll show you a picture right here. Carrot, of course, they picked her up on the on the Wano arc. Um, she was on that one place, and uh, she went with them to Wano. What was that place that they met up with? I, I don't know. I'm not going to spend too much time on it. Uh, she does have a, uh, a mode called uh, Shulong. It's basically the moon like hits you. It's kind of like a werewolf transformation. You get all husky. You look like a freaking uh, pimp ass glowing. Uh, I'll just show the picture. It's very hard to explain if you have no idea what I'm talking about. But it is cool. And she has some pretty husky fights. Uh, a lot of people were thinking she was going to be one of the newest Straw Hat Pirates. And uh, she did not join the Straw Hat Pirates. Uh, she wasn't even asked. She was asked to do another task. I'm not even going to get to that yet because I know in the anime they haven't talked about it. They just got to the end of the Kaido and Luffy fight. Uh, so I, that's all I've gotten up to. So I don't know if they've actually talked about Carrot. But she was husky. She fought Pedro. She did lose against Pedro. So... Uh, and she needed that dog and cat uh, guys to like help her out. I think the cat helped her out. And afterwards, she gave her a nice little hug and was like, "Ah, oh, thanks for helping me out." Um, did I say Pedro? Pedro is the dude that Pedro. Who the f Maybe this Pedro. No, Pedro was the dude who self-destructed and, and sacrificed his life. 
It's the pedo pedo guy, uh, the gooey dude. I can't, oh my god, how can I not remember gooey dude? I don't remember the gooey dude's name. But that was that guy. It was that guy, uh, Big Mom's little gooey dude who shot the sticky shit on you. Uh, taffy shit. Um, to make a long story short, that, that's what's going on on the Funko world. The news that broke today, uh, they also released that they're coming out with some other kind of Funko Pops and different genres. I really didn't care about them. That wasn't important to me. So now we're just going to go right into a Funko Pop right here that we got from Amazon because I did want to open something up and give you guys a little treat. <laughs> Look, I spoil you guys so much. Um, I don't know what is in this box specifically because I buy a lot of shit off Amazon. Hopefully I just don't cut the Funko Pop that's inside of here. And we will pop this open right here. Ugh, ugh. Pull in the back. Oh! Oh! All right, now, th th this is a pretty cool Funko Pop. Actually, I don't even know why it's such, like, a hot commodity in the Funko world. Because why am I saying it a hot commodity? Because I couldn't find it on Amazon anymore. It was sold out. Uh, it sold out at Hot Topic, Box Lunch, Target, wherever stores you want to go to other than, like, specialty stores. It is a Naruto Shippuden Funko Pop. We've, we've talked about it prior that it was coming out. We showed some pics. It is Uchiha Sasuke. That is right. It is Uchiha Sasuke. And it is the uh, mode where he just initiated having shoes and no. You see a little poat. I guess you can't see through the box. But we will take him out if I can find... Oh, here's the butter knife, baby. Bing, bing, bing. We're going to take him out and get a closer look before uh, this episode ends. And... I'm not kind of excited about this bad boy, because I really want to collect all the, at least the Naruto Shippuden Funko Pops, and maybe just the main guys. I was checking out um, during the week, they had a lot of specials going on at Box Launch and Hot Topic with the, the Ka Cash and the Box Launch Cash. Really didn't appeal to me at all. So here he is, it is Sasuke looking sweet, he has a podium, so I don't have to put anything under his feet for him to stand up. I will twirl this bad boy around. He is looking sweet. Here is the shoes and no. It's just getting formed. You know, he's just learning how to do it. And uh, yeah, here it is. The Magna Sharingan eyes after he got the transplant from his bro, Ski. And yeah, looking cool. Looking cool in my opinion. Uh, the Sasuke is basically their normal Sasuke. It looks like they used the same mold and just threw the purple shit on there and painted his eyes. Hey, you want to make a couple bucks? That's what you got to do. Uh, but this Funko Pop is definitely uh, pretty cool. He's going to go in my set. I'm going to put him back in a box, put him in a protector. And just a little spoiler here, I started to log my stuff into the Hobby DB shop. So pretty soon, I'm going to know how much money all my Funko Pops are worth. And I guarantee you this Sasuke ain't going to go past 20 bucks. But you know what? It is time for them glorious ups and them downs. That is right. We are going to first talk about the uh, the Minato 5 anime mystery box thing. Yeah, I'm going to give you an up. I'm going to give you an up. Funko, you have disappointed me in the past with your mystery boxes that I bought from you. The Freddy Funko one. Uh, some other one sucked balls. But hopefully you will come through with this one. And Sasuke. Oh, yeah. Shoe long uh, carrot. Oh, uh, Chopper and Mark. I'm just going to give you another up, up. And then we got Sasuke Kun. Uh, I'm going to give you an up as well. My name is Aaron. Thank you for joining me with 8 Minutes with Aaron. I will see you next time. Don't forget to like, subscribe, leave in the comments what you want to see, what you don't want to see. Because, hey, I will say it, I know I'm a lot handsomer than most other YouTubers. See you later. Bye.